Inventor makes it easy to review the results run from a modal analysis. Since this simulation was already run, let's examine the results. Expand the results node in the browser. Select the first frequency, then right click and select Activate. You can see that in the Results tab, there are eight different frequencies listed. This is because we selected to solve for eight mode shapes. When you look through the results, they are much different from the static load analysis. Move through the rest of the results by double clicking on each of them. You will not see safety factor or any other stress results. You are looking at the mode shapes that were created for the specific part that you did the simulation for. In this instance, you can see that the frequencies are starting at approximately 700 and going up to about 7000. For each of these mode shapes, you can start to see what direction they affected the part in. The frequencies correlate directly to displacement. This is combined from the XYZ directions. When you animate these, you can quickly see what patterns they were solved for. To do that, in the results tab, click animate and select the play button. You are seeing an exaggerated magnitude of displacement from the original shape of the object. Back in the browser tree, double click on the first mode shape and then expand displacement folder. You will see in this folder that there are options for viewing displacement in each direction for each mode shape. Double click on the X displacement and see how the color map on the part changes. If you wanted to change this part to increase its rigidity, you would need to edit the part and make it thicker. Note that by doing this, your color map and results may not look any better. You are simply making the object look for different natural frequencies that are hopefully out of the operating range of your part. Modal analysis can be very important to equipment and its desired operation because knowing how to solve vibration problems can be very helpful to the overall design of any product.